Naju, Elamgan, Tal Babaran, Menaduru, Moon Bumi, Guruyu, Yeda, Yenan, Bundan, Gauda Binga, Janya, Gual, you mobile on our country and welcome. We're on the beautiful Heron Island at the moment as part of the fifth cohort of the Master Reef Guide program. Heron Island is a beautiful coral atoll out towards the edge of the continental shelf and it's a very low island formed over the last couple of uh, thousand years and relatively untouched part of the Great Barrier Reef. We're just at the beginning of a week-long uh, intensive training block for the fifth cohort of the Master Reef Guides. And the program always begins with a welcome to country from local traditional owners. And in this case, uh, it was Uncle Mick Egmalisi, who's a Bayerli uh, elder uh, who lives in Gladstone, but whose country extends out to include Heron Island. It's really important that these events are foregrounded in that ownership. And then the program unfolds building on what the program is about and what the aspirations are for Master Reef Guides. The program really is to professionally develop the expertise of guides so they are real ambassadors for the reef. It's really important that a, a solid base is given on you know, what is the biology, what is the ecology, how management works, um, issues with the users of the reef, having a really good understanding of you know, the traditional ownership of this, of this sea country as well. You know, having formal training so you know, the guides are learning from you know, the experts themselves and then they're armed with the latest and greatest in knowledge. We thought we were coming to learn more about coral polyps and zoos and thalli, and we have come away from this as knowing about so much more about the history of this place, and I just think that is so special. We have a massive area that we're coming here on the east coast of Queensland. It is 2,300 kilometres long, and we need to make sure that not only are we protecting it, but also that everyone who is coming to this area, everyone who is enjoying it, realises that we all need to come together to protect this space. We're so fortunate to live in a place with such extraordinary natural and cultural beauty and I think that should be celebrated by all Australians. Mm -hmm.